Hi, welcome to Star Guided Tarot and the Daily Tea for tomorrow, April 2nd. I hope you guys are all doing well today. Let's see, happy April, right? We got new month, new moon, new, all new everything, let's hope, right? Um, let's see here. So, uh, messages for my collective, please, spirit. In the pre shuffle, I was seeing the three, or the three pentacles came out with the world. That could mean a lot of different things. Some of you guys, maybe you work online, maybe you travel for your job, maybe you're completing a job, like for those of you who are like contractors, but this is like a completion of one project and starting a new. Um, it's an achievement, working together towards a common goal. Um, others of you, it may be a completion of a job period, stepping into a new experience, uh, leaving one job behind, but um, that can mean a lot of different things there. So we're going to go ahead and just see how that plays into the reading, all right? So messages for my collective. You have the bow. You are highly thought of. So you are highly thought of by somebody, by spirit, by your family, your friends, your loved ones, whoever. We'll see. Maybe just in the spotlight. Maybe it's by a boss even, you know? Okay, so... Messages for my collective. All right, that is plenty. Okay. Ooh. All right, so bottom of the deck is a peacock. Beware of great pride. Now, this could be you. Or this could be somebody around you. Beware of great pride. Whatever that may be. I always see this as someone who's like puffing out their chest and strutting their stuff around, right? With that peacock. Um, so I don't know who this is or what it is. Someone who's... Uh, beware of great pride, though. You are highly thought of. So even if you think you're not. So I don't know if this... I don't know whose energy that is. But beware of great pride. You have the goldfish. Increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. We have the clouds. Temporary problems. And there's also the tent. A temporary situation. It's very interesting because before I... Well, as I was doing all the pre-shuffling and shit, I was thinking about the Leo reading. And in Leo's reading, this like primitive type of energy was coming through. But then as I was doing the pre-shuffle today, I was thinking, you know what? That sounds something like someone planning like a camp trip. So I don't know if some of y'all are planning some kind of camping trip or something even. Because it just made me think of it when I saw the tent. Um, but either way, there is going to be some kind of problems here. All right? Temporary problems. Okay. Both of these temporary problems and temporary situation, it says. But there's a need to beware of great pride. And you have the tortoise slowly but surely getting ahead. And the throne position of authority. Some of you guys are, someone, I'm telling you, someone going on damn vacation. These vacation cards just keep coming up in my readings. All right, some of you guys maybe, like I said, you're planning some kind of a vacation here. Maybe, you know, there's temporary problems regarding that. Uh, maybe you're planning this camping trip and there's going to be some kind. Maybe it starts raining on you. I don't know. Either way, you are highly thought of, but there's going to be some kind of temporary problems here and you need to be aware of great pride. You are slowly but surely getting ahead in this position of authority. So maybe you're headed to it's that, that three of pentacles in that world, right? That's like a completion. It's success. It's achievement. Okay? Absolutely. Um, so some of you guys, this is like a promotion. Maybe you're starting your own business. Maybe things are going to pick up in your business. We'll see. Um, let's get one from this deck here with the situations. Let's see what the situation is. What's the situation? Whew, messages for my collective. Okay, so this card was showing face yesterday. I don't remember which reading, but the realization, awareness, finding out, and coming to light. Oof, da. Okay, so um, got the access granted. Social media, fake profile, and hiding. Okay, so if you've been blocked or, so, or if you've blocked somebody, either you're still watching or they're still watching, right? Either way. 
Maybe someone found out you blocked their ass and now they're like trying to find, you know what I mean? Now they're on your shit on a fake profile. Um, or something gets brought to light here and it causes whatever this problem is. It's almost like, see these clouds? The clouds, but there's a coming to light. Um, it's like the cloud, I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see her. Let's see. Two or more people discussing and planning some kind of offer or proposal here. There's some kind of offer on the table here. Now, this could be in regards to job, uh, love, whatever it is for your situation. This could be job, a new home, a commit, I mean, commit, whatever it is. And then there's the masculine energy. So I could be speaking with my masculines here or my feminines. You're dealing with this masculine, whatever the case. Um, so somebody's definitely going through an awakening here with this increase in spiritual um, uh, growth here and this ascension. So some, this is this is a, an ascension process here. Someone's going through a change possibly with this hamster wheel, surviving daily hustle. So there may be some money issues even right now. But see here, someone's definitely online looking, searching, whatever the fuck, a third party, a karmic who's jealous as fuck of you, gossiping, talking shit, whoever. Um, beware of great pride. I don't know what this is about here, but there's definitely with this access granted and this watching and this searching and all this jealous, gossiping, envious energy here. Two or more people discussing, talking shit, who knows. Um, but I'm telling you what, someone who has been avoiding you, running from you, whatever the fuck here, is watching you. Someone from the past, whoever it is, it could be this fucking karmic, it could be this masculine, whoever it is, I don't know. Um, but looky here, it's very interesting because this is kind of the same energy as yesterday with the proof. The proof. It's like someone's got the proof they need in order to get this child support, in order to get this alimony, something like that. And we got this tuned in, internet and connected, but someone's feeling threatened. Maybe these, someone's online, right? Maybe, so, you know what I mean? Threatening you, watching you, all this gossiping or trying to embarrass you, humiliate you, or this person, whoever's watching you, feels fucking threatened and embarrassed. Why? Because I don't know, but maybe you, what the hell? Okay, we got some shit going on here. Somebody, okay, threatened, embarrassed appearances. In regards to some kind of, some I don't know, entrapment. Or someone feels threatened because they are trapped in a corner with all this proof, whatever the fuck. But someone's done. Completion. Lesson learned. Trash. Discarded. Throwing out. Retaliation. Punish. Payback. Revenge. Triggers. And legal. Court paperwork. Filed. And then we have this bounty hunter. Bounty hunter. Legalities. What the hell to type it? What the fuck? So someone's like, I don't know. It's interesting. Someone may be, someone's definitely pretending all up in their head, stressed out, on the verge, about to reveal, about to confess, some kind of fucking commitment where they're feeling trapped in. Maybe they bought a home together or there's a selling of a home. Whatever the fuck, it has something to do with this home, this tent, this situation, this foundation. There's, I feel like there may be children involved here. Let's keep going here. Messages for my collective, please. This fucking energy. And look, there goes that vacation again. Vacation. There's something to do with a vacation, y'all. Vacation and too much concern with sexual matters. So someone may have went on some kind of little vacation, some little escapade or whatever, and someone finds out that someone went and had some kind of fucking love affair on their little escapade, and now someone wants all this revenge. It's like someone's got the fucking proof, man. This is that same energy as yesterday. Okay, so when I quit recording last night, I looked at the bottom of the deck, and he had the feminine next to the devil, okay, or the empress, right? Remember, um, it was all the... Uh, uh, the, the same nasty energy coming up from around the divine feminine yesterday. So it's either the, the divine feminine, either you're the one who's like, you know, beware of your great pride. There's something like something going to try to come get you out of character. You know what I mean? Something. 
wanting some kind of revenge or this is just another feminine energy hope and wishing and praying for some kind of intervention some kind of rescue um hope and wishing praying and then intervention rescue others involved goodness Taking a gamble, taking a risk, nightlife. There goes that Vegas shit again. Some of y'all, this has something to do with going to Vegas for reals. I've been hearing a lot about people going to Vegas. TikTok, though, deadline running out in regards to some kind of love. If someone got cut the fuck off, someone did absolutely cut off. Drastic. And then there goes that talk, conversate, get on the same page, twin flame. But love affair. So some of y'all, this person was just trying to keep you as a little love affair. Or you found out about this little love affair, this dirty little secret. And someone getting cut the fuck off. I mean, this is, this here is that same energy. It's like this. I think it's Leo's reading, y'all. But the hell? Let's see here. Something to do with the vacation, though, for sure. And then someone's fucking beginning to realize something... A light gets shed on a situation and someone wants fucking payback, man. That's just all there is to it. I don't know. Someone, like I said, went on some kind of little escapade, little vacation, but I don't like this fucking energy that keeps coming up here. So there goes that running, that avoiding here energy again. Running, avoiding, disappearing. Yeah, so someone may have ran, disappeared here. And went on some kind of little hideaway, little adventure, some little escapade here. And someone, I'm telling you what, the truth is getting revealed. Fucking pride, ego, stubborn, stubborn lover, arrogant, egotistical, prideful person here. So I don't know if this is your warning, you know, beware of great pride. Or like I said, this is this person that's around you, you know emotional whirlwind and consequences karma <sighs> yeah someone gonna get some karma for their pride and their ego someone's emotions are all out of the i don't know slowly but surely getting ahead vacation but too vacation and too much concern with sexual matters pleasure with a close friend and younger woman Oh, sheet. Telling you what it is. It's just another feminine energy. I don't think it's the divine feminine, but it's another feminine energy. <coughs> <coughs> or something. Or divine feminine, you found out, find out about this shit. You know, I don't know, but oof, duh. <coughs> we got the elusive, dis dishonest, and tricky. All this running, ghosting, disappearing, invinci invisible energy. Yeah. But see her? Shock. The shock. Shocking. Unexpected trouble. Shocking. Something coming to light, I'm telling you. And then this all this retaliation, resentment, and angerness, bitterness. We're done. Releasing. Walking, ag walking away. Yeah, there's temporary problems, all right. Beware. Someone needs to be aware of their pride and their ego here. Whoever that is. Oof. Could be Aquarius energy here, but this is this betrayal, major betrayal. So I feel like it gets found out here. A major betrayal. Yeah. Ten of Swords. Retaliation, punish, payback, revenge. <sighs> Got the two of wands here. Two of wands. Uh, crossroads. Being at a distance even. This is this, uh, someone highly, you know, this could be someone thinking about you from a distance. But this is this vacation, this going somewhere here. Um, going, but this is being at a crossroads as well with this temporary situation and this, this moving we were seeing there. We'll see here. There goes the seven of swords. See them tents back there? So someone, this is this tricky fucking 
disappearing, ghosting fucking energy that we're seeing, y'all. This is this elusive energy. Dishonest, tricky, but I'm telling you, upheaval, the shock. This is going down a new path here. Um, there goes that ten of wands. There goes the ten of wands. Yeah, that's that under pressure. Uh, I'm telling you, consequences. That's that. Uh, that's definitely that under pressure. This is this embarrassment as well. Hiding. Someone's watching, but they're hiding behind. So, so, so you block this person. I, I feel like this person needs to get up. Someone's trying to get up some kind of strength and courage here. Um, to take a gamble, to take a risk even. But having a hard time. But this is also like packing up and going somewhere. Literally luggage. Luggage. If you're going on a vacation, be careful of like, I don't know. Just thieves around you? I don't fucking know. It's like someone trying to steal and take everything they can carry from this fucking tent. It's like someone trying to take what they can on the way out. Or someone's just literally moving out or whatever because someone's a fucking sneak. Someone planning some shit. Or this is just this person who's sneakily watching you and shit. Man, this can go so many ways. There goes the nine of wands, though. You got the nine and the ten. This is very heavy. It's mentally taking a toll. It's mentally, emotionally taxing. Um, it's a lot of somebody who's been through a lot, right? This is expect trouble. Expecting trouble, but wounded warrior as well. Why? Because this person's a, someone's uh, sneaky. But this is beware, you know, like expect trouble. Um, keep your guard up. Someone's really walled off, guarded even. There goes the empress. The empress. So that's that feminine energy, y'all. Drama queen. Ready to explode. Anchor. Chain. Weighed down. Under pressure, about to fucking, ex I'm telling you, and it is, it's a f feminine, divine feminines, could be a mother, there could be a pregnancy, doesn't have to be, but I don't like this energy, it's almost like someone is, uh, someone, something gets brought to light here, and I almost feel like it's to get you out of character, divine feminine, I don't know, we'll see, oof, there goes the emperor, so got the Empress and the Emperor here, the masculine to the feminine. This is what, this could be the prideful, egotistical, sneaky, whoever it is. It's one or the other. It's one or the other. Either this Empress is planning an escape, or it's this Empress who's planning, wanting all this punish, payback, revenge, or this Emperor was sneaking around and got someone, could have gotten someone knocked up, or the Empress was sneaking around and may have gotten knocked up. I mean, it doesn't have to be, but she does represent pregnancy. Um, it doesn't have to, though, but I'm telling you what, someone is hiding secrets, mysteries, and hiding, hiding, hiding. Fake profile, social media, and hiding. Hiding, sneaking, mysteries, lies, and boundaries. No. Drawing the line. Yeah, I feel like you guys did. Loyalty, beauty, and clinging. Holding on, watching. Yeah. Empress. What a... So someone... This person definitely sees your work. I mean, sees you as the empress. But they're letting their pride and their ego get in the way. There goes that ace of swords, though. This is this truth. This is this clarity. This is this truth coming out here. This is a card of victory. It's a card of severing ties as well. Um, there goes the three of swords. Oof, yeah. So this could be something like the truth hurts. That's what I'm saying. Someone's got the proof of some shit, man. Y'all have to let me know. But it's like someone knows their time is running out. Someone definitely got cut the fuck off here. Um, twin flame. Waves of emotions coming and going. 
irreconcilable differences, divorce, final agreement, settlement and compromise, coming to an agreement, a compromise, but some kind of unexpected sur surprise, we're done here, separation. Someone's like a planning their escape here because this is like packing up and leaving like seriously. There goes the lovers. That's that twin flame energy we're just seeing here, right? Someone's wanting to talk, conversate, and get on the same page. So whoever the fuck was cut off here, watching. This is having a choice in love as well. We have the three here. We have a three here. We got the seven of swords and the two of wands. Choices between two here. Yeah. A decision being made here, though, for sure. The seven to the ace is the eight. That's that feeling trapped. That's that lockdown, that mental prison someone's in. Um, but the, the lovers is a is a unexpected, it's an unexpected, unexpected agreement, settlement, something silence, crickets, soulmate, but in a panic, in a panic. So whoever this soulmate is, where there's been no communication and no action, this person's like in a panic because someone's been blocked off or something. And, and, and someone is like going, they're going through a divorce and ending because this is also a contract here. Unexpected, unexpected, something unexpected, y'all, because you keep seeing the tower here, consequences, unexpected trouble, bitterness, anger, and we're done here. So it's like there's an ending of one and someone's getting put, I, I mean, this is someone, man, I'm getting so many messages. I can't figure it out. We got the ten of wands or five of wands and the outcome, no drama. That's all this fucking drama. Temporary problems because someone wants some kind of revenge. Someone's planning to like, I don't know if someone wants to fight somebody here. This could just be a legal battle, right? But I don't like all this. I'm telling you, drama queen, ready to explode and causing drama here. Retaliation, punish, payback, and revenge. Archangel Michael's trying to show someone the signs, synchronicities. On the verge, about to reveal, about to confess, but all up in their fucking head about it. See this truth, this honest, this is all, the truth. But all up in their head with the seven and the ace it makes the eight. Feeling trapped in a situation, bought a home with somebody, long-term relationship. There's children involved for sure, but there's some kind of negotiations going on. Someone could be begging, bar, you know, begging somebody. I don't know. But we got some, this negotiations going on, begging, lusty sexual energy, begging. Ooh. Let's keep going here. Someone may get off their rock, you know what I mean? This is someone who's very arrogant, egotistical. We see that with the pride here. I don't know if this person makes you, likes to make you beg for their love, attention, everything. I don't know what's going on here, but there's some kind of major betrayal here. A painful separation. The truth, the, the truth hurts here. The truth hurts. Yeah, this is violent. This is hostile and it's violent, y'all. This is like a crime of passion. This is like somebody raging out and I just want to fucking hurt you. I want to fight you. I want to... I'm telling you, this is like someone who's coming in for the kill. Coming in for the kill. Exactly what lions do. I'm telling you, the truth is going to get revealed with the high priestess. Whatever's hidden, whatever these mysteries, these secrets, whatever's being hidden here, I'm telling you what. This is like, this is an, a, 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 yes, devil energy. Someone is in a very, very, very dark place right now. This is abusive. It's toxic. It's lashing out. It's extremely dark energy. Um, but you see here, this is like a final decision. We're done here. Final decision. Someone getting sprung upon like divorce papers here. And, but someone is absolutely going to be fucking leaving her. Um, 
Yeah, someone, it's a major betrayal, but, um, ten ten. Completion, completion. Got the three of cups. Yeah, major betrayal. Third party bullshit. Three, three, three. Choices in love here. Cheating. Tra I'm telling you what. Yeah, there's a major betrayal. This could be a friend. I'm telling you, we saw that. Pleasure with a close friend and a younger woman. This is, you know what? This is like someone who's just fucking ruthless. You know, I just heard this is someone who will go like dance on your grave and shit. Oof. It's like celebrating. Oh, my God. I am telling you. I do not like this energy, y'all. Fucking five of swords, seven of swords, three of swords, five, ten of swords, knight of swords, five of wands. I mean, this is someone coming in for the kill, literally. I'm telling you what. Someone thinks they're going to get away with, like, murder or something. I do not like this fucking energy. Someone is being absolutely fucking nasty. Oh my God, upheaval, the shock, unexpected trouble, resentment, stinging words, bitterness, anger. I don't give a fuck, dude. This is like, I don't give a fuck. Here's the harsh, cold, fucking raw truth and it's gonna hurt. Is this, or is this somebody who is dealing with this type of person here? Like, man, I don't like this energy. There goes, there goes. I'm telling you, someone's having a hard time. This is like the burden of proof, the burden of the truth here. We see that. Someone's embarrassed because someone's getting revealed. The truth is going to get revealed or this person's having a hard time revealing the truth. Um, but this is, oh God, I don't like this energy. I don't like this energy. Fucking death. Mm, mm-mm. -mm. Shocking, unexpected ending. We're done here. Completion, but I don't know. I do not like this. This is like an actual, I mean, I'm telling you, this is like some kind of crime of passion or something. There goes the Empress. It is. It's this female energy that's under all this pressure. Or it's this female who's the one hiding, watching, planning, plotting even. But with all this pressure here, this is a lot. Ten of wands twice and the nine of wands. I mean, it's all surrounding this feminine energy. I'm telling you, anchor chain weighed down, pressure cooker. Someone hoping, wishing, praying for help out of a situation here. Toxic love. Yeah, that's a major ending. 10, 10, 10 with the death. What's this emperor? It's the emperor. It's the emperor that's feeling trapped. It's the emperor is all up in his head here. This emperor needs to take his power back and step out of his comfort zone and get out of his head here. The eight plus ace is the nine. Stressed out, worried, hurt, upset. <sighs> Needing to take that gamble. Someone knows. That some, I'm telling you, tick tock. Someone knows. They need to take this, this gamble here. Ace of swords to the temperance. So you could be dealing with a Sag. Gemini. Aries, Taurus. Libra. Scorpio, um, Leo with this lion, Ace of Swords though, this is coming in to bring, I mean, this is getting the victory, getting the success, this is peace, balance, harmony, it's divine timing, it's patience, um, someone, this is like coming in even to like try to test the water even, because I'm telling you, someone's having a really hard time, or, um, this is, uh, Getting so many different messages, especially with like the, all this, uh, that embarrassment shit we were seeing here. It's like someone, 
It's like on that verge, but. Hmm, <sighs> two cards of victory. I feel like Archangel Michael is definitely protecting you. Oh, yes, because this is this sort of protection. And we were just seeing, I was just seeing the Archangel Michael with the signs. Showing someone, Archangel Michael is showing somebody the signs, the synchronicities, the truth. I mean, it's the truth here. Um, uh, healing energy, though. Losing patience, losing frustration, you know, getting frustrated. We see all that. Yeah, this is a separation. Two cups. And the lovers and the four wands. This, yeah, this is that twin flame energy. This is that twin flame energy that we were seeing next to like the commitment and shit card. So it goes in all, in, okay, so there's a soulmate, okay, so it, okay. Some of y'all are dealing with a twin, I don't fucking know here, but there's the soulmate who's in all this fucking panic, anxiety, the, I mean, we have the, the divine soulmates here, the emperor to the empress and the lovers and the two of cups and this angel working up these two of cups. Someone's needing to make a head over heart decision, a well balanced decision here, whatever the case. Come in, you know, make peace, test the waters. I don't know what's going on here, but this person is in a panic. This uh, soulmate, but there's been no communication because we see all this fucking blocked, drastic, extreme, harsh, cut off energy, love affair, some kind of dirty little secret. I don't know, but we have this talk, conversate, wanting, and then, you know, get on the same page. But then there's this, um, so we have the twin flame here, the soulmate here, but then here comes all this unexpected divorce final, we're done here, coming to a settlement, an agreement here, but this is also this marriage contract, but it's also like, both of these cards represent like twin, tw twin flames, that's the 1111 and the, and the, and the, and the lovers. So somebody has a choice in love in a marriage, in this situation here. But this is also this marriage contract. Someone got themselves, bought a home, got themselves in some kind of contract with somebody. Right? Married them, bought a home. But someone is now, it's like someone planning their fucking escape. Or like I said, someone went on some kind of vacation and someone finds out about a man. Take it how it resonates for you. Someone may fear marriage, right? Um, it's like, you know, if this is like a long-term situation, but you've already taken all the steps, but this person isn't taking it any further even, I'm not sure. But I will see, I mean, so, pleasure with a close friend and a younger woman. Someone causing shit, man. And yeah, look, someone give me my money. I'm telling you, this is that negotiations we were just seeing, that begging type of energy. This is all that legalities that we're seeing. You know? Settlement, agreement, coming to a compromise. Uh, but someone going, I'm telling you, some unexpected divorce or someone going to pop, someone... Someone is 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 being a nasty doll. I just I don't know how else to put it here, but see, let's see. I how Holmes about to reveal, about to confess all this mental prison, pretending, living beyond means, fake commitment. Yeah, someone's been. He that's the fucking truth. I'm not fucking happy here. I'm pretending. It's all fake. Whatever it is, happy, happy uh, that they portray to the world, it's all false in this commitment. But somebody, I'm telling you, bought a home, sold a home, <clears throat> married, or it's just some kind of long-term commitment, definitely kids involved. 
and there's all these negotiations going on negotiation begging bargaining but interlude divine timing divine timing um i'm telling you it's like that fucking this is like that drama queen that thirsty i'm telling you causing chaos it, and Archangel Michael is trying to show someone the signs and the synchronicities here. I don't know. Tragedy. Forbidden love. Tragedy. Yeah, this may end in tragedy, alright. I mean, seriously. This is not good energy. Like, I'm, I still stand by, like, or someone just leaving this whole toxic shit behind, period. Because it's just too much. It's too much. Roller coaster, yeah. And current status, becoming single, becoming available, I guess. Going through with this divorce, escaping the situation. I don't know, y'all. This is some fucky energy, but yeah, there's definitely a fight going on here. Needing to get on the same page, I guess, here in regards to these negotiations, those assets, whatever the hell, um, whatever legalities there is going on here. This but this is also this payback type of energy. Punish, payback, revenge. You can't make it up. Someone is literally coming in for the kill. Oh, that's what I got. If you like the video, hit the like button, leave a comment, subscribe, and be safe. And until tomorrow, love, light, and blessings.